We have two championships in the WWE and more championships mean that you can have more champions. Look if there's two candies more people will eat. What I'm trying to say, two world championships mean more opportunity. I suck at examples. In this video I'm going to rank top 5 superstars who either should win the WWE Championship or the Universal Championship in 2017. Number 5, Sami Zayn Universal Championship. So Sami Zayn is on Monday Night Raw and he's probably a guy who benefited from the brand split the least. Like I don't know what he's doing in the WWE at the moment, like he was successful in NXT, he got some success on the main roster when the brand split didn't exist, but now where is this guy? Instead of drafting him to SmackDown, they decided to just don't do anything with him at all. Either way, I think 2017 should be the year of Sami Zayn. He's a tremendous wrestler and he deserves a run with the Universal Championship. Kevin Owens is the champion at the moment and I think Sami Zayn is going to win that championship some day. It seems unlikely, but if WWE are smart enough, they will do something about it. I think he should win the Universal Championship in 2017 and maybe, maybe in a feud against Kevin Owens and triple threat feud because I, I really don't want to see that feud again because you know, it, it got kind of stale. Either way, he deserves that championship. But life is not fair, I deserve more subscribers and views, but life is tough. Number 4, John Cena WWE World Championship. Okay now, I might not be the biggest John Cena fan, and I'm not saying that I really love John Cena beating Ric Flair's record, but if he would do something like NWO style group, a heel turn John Cena, like if he would turn heel, he would be obsessed with beating Ric Flair's record, I wouldn't even mind him beating the record. And even though I hated John Cena for the last 10 years, I would like to say that he's actually a good wrestler. Like I guess all we hated is overexposure, you know, over push and stuff. Like let me say you love pizza, you know, if you would eat that every day, I don't know, you would start to hate it, you, your shit would look like pizza. Why am I so obsessed with shit these days? What the heck? So he'll turn John Cena beating the record, being a one badass guy, I can deal with it. Number 3 Bray Wyatt WWE World Champion it's about time since Bray Wyatt gets a push into WWE. I really hope that he beats Randy Orton in the feud. I'm a much bigger fan of Randy because he's one of my favorites of all time, but still it doesn't mean I don't want to see a younger guy succeed. I wasn't the biggest fan of Bray Wyatt when he debuted because to me he basically looked like a guy who would f*** a goat. Bray Wyatt was screwed a lot in the WWE and it's about damn time he gets that world championship and 2017 seems like a good year for him to be a champion so let's hope that by the end of 2017 we will have buzzards following bray or something number two cesaro universal champion it seems unlikely, but I think he should win the championship, like if brand split means opportunity and Kevin Owens is champion, Cesaro is another guy who should be a universal champion, I think he should be even sooner than Sami Zayn. Like I wouldn't say that I'm one of those guys who are just so highly about Cesaro and you know, loves him so much, but the stuff WWE says about him is just stupid. Like they say that the crowd is not behind Cesaro, even though like they... They love this guy. So stop lying and make this guy a champion. I wouldn't even mind him as you know the United States champion, but being universal champion would be great for that guy. He really deserves it, he works his ass off, he puts great matches, and it's about damn time we see him as the universal champion. So let's hope 2017 is the year of Cesaro. And number one might be shocking, but Chris Jericho. Now many of you would say that this is too late for that, but I strongly disagree. Like he's the most interesting part of Monday Night Raw right now and if you make him a Universal Champion, it it would be great. Like Kevin Owens, Chris Jericho rivalry, that's the money, like that's the biggest rivalry I want to see right now. You can already see that these two guys are arguing with each other and I think the feud is coming. Either at Survivor Series or later we are going to see Universal Championship between Kevin Owens and Chris Jericho. I highly doubt that Chris Jericho is going to win because he is leaving the WWE but if they would promise him the Universal Championship run, I think he would stay in the WWE, I, I really do. Not only it would be the most entertaining thing in WWE Raw, it would also bring a lot of prestige to Universal Championship. So who should be the champ in 2017 or 16? Chris Jericho. I disagree. You know what you just did? 
I'm gonna start my own list. The list of the great one. You know what? You just made the list. People who don't want to see Jericho as Universal Champion. You like that? Think about what you've done. Thanks for watching this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. And make sure to watch my career mode series because those are amazing. You're not going to watch it, right? You're not watching it. Guess what I'm gonna do? Make a guess. You just made the fucking list. People who don't watch my career. I guess you're happy now. The Great One, peace. You know what? I'm not going to give you peace, love, and hugs. You already made the list.